Hello everyone. So in one of my last videos, I showed how to build a custom entry control for the .NET MAUI uh, by essentially building a piece of a code which is enabling you to build uh, an entry control which has borders uh, which you can where you can change the colors of the borders itself. Now, what I also did in that video, I also talked a bit about uh, the reasons why I think this should be enabled out of the box so that you don't have to uh, go over this pain to essentially make this working. And during all this thing, I was not actually testing how this entry is working on uh, iOS. And uh, I just trusted that this is working exactly the same as it was working on Xamarin, which was uh, obviously not the case as some of you uh, saw this and reported that there is an uh, exception uh, when doing a uh, cast there, which is uh, obviously very, very basic error that I had uh, during the, the coding of, the, of that product. So obviously I haven't tested it on the iOS and now it's time to redeem myself and to build a bit of a better piece of a code, which is working as expected. So the approach is pretty much the same. We still have the custom entry, which is of a type entry. And we have a couple of bindable properties, which you can set in your XAML, same as I did it right here. So this is the way how you can do it. You should include the namespace controls. My controls are living exactly in this namespace. And then I have my custom entry with a bit of a text. I put a green color as a border color. It's very visible. And uh, I put a border thickness and a border, uh, sorry, corner radius. So this is what I did. I also put padding and a height request so that everything is a bit more uh, visible. Now, uh, what I also did, obviously I built uh, the, the custom entry mapper for the Android, which looks something like this. And for the iOS, uh, exactly the same story. There is a custom uh, entry mapper, which is changed, but this one is actually working. So I don't know, will it work in a newer version of the uh, MAUI, but uh, in uh, .NET 7, it works as expected. So. Uh, let me show you how this works. So let me just switch to the team viewer quickly. And uh, yeah, this is essentially the rendering of the control in the in the iOS. And as you can see, I can uh, go inside, I can uh, type things. Um, I can also go into the classic entry and I can do the same thing. So as you can see here, the, the difference, uh, visual difference between those two is, is obvious. So I guess you can uh, maybe a benefit a bit from the from the UI um, that is uh, given to you by using this uh, custom entry control. Um, this very much the same look and feel is in the Android itself. So if you just open the Android emulator, so I have already prepared one, and uh, if I just quick play here, uh, the Android version of the application will start and. Uh, it will have uh, very much the same um, entry, which is, in my opinion, in Android, uh, even a bit better because the classic one really doesn't give you, um, you know, much of a flexibility to make it to make it better. So, the classic one works as expected, and as you can see, even the the custom one works exactly as you would like it. So, um, I think it's. Uh, it's it's a better piece of code than it was before so my apologies for uh you know this uh issue that i caused and maybe some frustration that you guys did uh have when when you were using my code um i'm hoping that i'm going to redeem myself by actually publishing this code somewhere uh, in some repository which i'm going to put a link in the description so that you can really clone this and run locally and uh, i hope that you won't have too many issues. Uh, one thing that I have to say is that, uh, you know, the code here is not the prettiest. Of, of course, it's not the prettiest. Uh, I, I didn't really care about this. It's, it's also, in some cases, you might get exceptions or something like this. So you can be a bit more defensive in your uh, implementations of the code. And uh, yeah, just remember, this is really more or less for, uh, you know, learning to, to get a bit of a grip on how to work with those custom entries and really also to evaluate the platform itself. You know, do you really want to uh, go uh, with the same process when you're building another control? But, you know, I think it's, uh, it's quite an interesting approach and uh, obviously here it works. 
But uh, yeah, if anyone from .NET Maui team listens to this, you know, guys, uh, maybe it wouldn't be too bad to have this uh, out of the box so that people really don't have to struggle with uh, setting this up. So that's essentially it. Thank you very much for your time. And I hope that this is going to be helpful. Bye, everyone.